Hello everyone, I am Mr. K. Babu, Assistant Professor, Department of Physics, Kayser College of Arts and Science, Parvima, Thirichungar. In this lecture video, we are going to discuss about light a wave or a particle and also explain the Compton effect. First, the photon momentum and uncertainty principle. Uh, the outline of this video, photon having the momentum, we explain from the Compton scattering and the wave pocket resolution of the optical microscope. The first one is uh, light is wave or particles. Light is always both waves and particles. It is also explained from the classical mechanical concept. On macroscopic scale, large number of photons look like an eclipse only a wave phenomena. A single photon is still a wave but your act of trying to measuring it makes it looks like a localized particle. Do photon having the momentum? What is the momentum? E is equal to half mv squared. Uh, we divided into v uh, separately half mv dot v. Uh, we have to put mv is equal to v. We already know half p dot v. Just like energy, the total momentum is always conserved. P is equal to e by v. Uh, we substitute e is equal to h by c. Uh, p is equal to h mu divided by c. Both are the momentum concept. So that the photon also having the momentum. Photon have energy and, it, and a finite velocity, so there is the must be some momentum associated with the photons. The next one is the photon momentum configuration. In free space, E is equal to Cp. When we need P is equal to E divided by C, substituting E is equal to H, mu, H omega divided by C. Uh, omega by C is equal to uh, K, that is the K wave vector H cross K. In optical material, E is equal to Vp dot B, we, we need P is equal to E divided by Vp. Substituting E is equal to H cross omega divided by Vp. Uh, we substituting omega divided by Vp is equal to Hk Vac dot N. That is the wave vector function. In Compton effect, the first Compton effect uh, uh, derived from the Compton in 1924, he performed where the X-ray symbols on the matter and he measured in the scattering radiation. Uh, the target electron at the rest position, when, when we passing through the incident uh, photon lambda i, it falls on the dark target electron uh, at rest positions, it is diffracted from the recalling emission and the scattering emission. Uh, the scattered light photon energy lambda f minus lambda i is equal to delta lambda h divided by m naught c 1 minus cos theta. We substituting e is equal to h c divided by lambda or p is equal to h by lambda. Uh, he derived from the Compton scattering and the first energy uh, when the light photon targeting from the electron it scattered uh, proved from the Compton effect. Compton found that if you treat the photon as if if they were particle of zero mass with the energy E is equal to H C divided by lambda and the momentum B is equal to H divided by lambda. Measuring the position and the momentum of an electron. Uh, from the Planck concept E is equal to H C divided by lambda, a photon with the uh, short wavelength has the large energy. But to determine its momentum accurately, electron must only be given a small kick. Thus, the electron having the measuring position and momentum through the microscope it virtually. Next one is the electron microscope. The electron microscope is the device with using the wave behavior of an electron to make uh, images which are, which are others too small size for the visible light. The image was taken with the scanning electron microscope. The scanning electron microscope will solve a feature as the small than 5 nanometer. N means nanometer. This is about the 100 times better than the uh, normal microscope. This is the sample example for the same image. Thank you.